Jessie V, and in today's video I'm going to be telling you guys a bunch of very creepy stories, and one has to do with the reason why you should never listen to Happy Birthday Backwards. Before we get started though, as you guys can see, I have a brand new backdrop behind me. This one is so nice, I don't think I've ever done like a space sort of themed backdrop, but as you can see, it's a lake at night, you can see the trees far off in the distance, and above in the sky there are a bunch of planets and stars, I think it's so beautiful. I'm I'm so sad my camera can't show like even further up on the backdrop because there's so many more planets above me that you can't see. It's wonderful. So before I get into how to win this new backdrop, I have to announce the winner of last month's backdrop. That was for the Harry Potter background. And the winner is Creepy Julia. Congratulations. And thank you to everybody else that entered to win. Now, if you guys would like to win this dark lake space background behind me, all you have to do is be subscribed to this channel, so my Jessie V channel, turn on your notification bell, and then head over to my Instagram page, Jessie V, give it a follow, and DM me the black heart emoji. That's like my favorite emoji to use. If you DM me that, you are entered. Now this month, I'm letting you guys to have a second entry. So usually when you enter to win the backdrop, you get one entry, your name goes in once. This time, I'm allowing you guys to have a second entry, so double chance to win. This one is optional, but if you would like to head over to my my vlog channel, it's called V Vlogs, and watch the video called This Needs to Be Said. All you have to do is watch it, give me a comment on there, and that's the second entry to win. The reason why I'm doing the second entry is because this video is very important to me. I want as many of you guys to watch it as possible, but like I said, that one is optional. Totally up to you if you want your name to be put in twice. All right, guys, so before I get into this video, I have one more thing to announce. We have a bunch of new awesome things on the website. The first thing is, let me just grab him. We have this new octopus unicorn plushie. It is so cute, so soft. I collect weird things like this. It's just so cool how it's a regular animal that's been made mystical, you know what I mean? So if you guys would like one, I've linked it down below. Limited time only. We also have some new sock designs that actually go with this backdrop really well. The first one is alien socks, and the next one is socks that say, I need my space. Get it? And it has like a sparkly moon on it. So if you guys would like any of these things, I've linked it down below. All right, so without further ado, let's get right into this video. The very first story is called Happy Birthday Backwards. This is a story about two best friends named Hannah and Alicia who discovered something terrifying. One day, Alicia came to school and told Hannah that she downloaded this app on her phone that played songs backwards. So it made the song sound either really creepy or really funny. So the two girls sat outside at recess playing all of their favorite songs backwards. They sat there laughing and gasping at the strange sounds coming from their phone, and everything was all fun and games until the next day. Alicia came to school as pale as a ghost. She wouldn't make eye contact with anybody, she wouldn't talk to anyone, and when Hannah asked her what was wrong, she just shook her head and refused to answer. So Hannah continued to beg her to tell her what the heck was going on, and finally Alicia said, I tried happy birthday. And Hannah was super confused at first as to what she meant, but then Alicia continued, I tried tried playing happy birthday backwards. So Hannah asked her what it sounded like, but Alicia did not want to continue her story. She just ran off to class. At lunchtime, Hannah said she wanted to hear happy birthday backwards as well, but Alicia said it wasn't a good idea, but Hannah begged her. So they both walked into a janitor's closet where it was quiet and listened to the song. Now, Hannah wasn't the same after that. She went the rest of the day not talking to anybody. And when she went home, her parents were really concerned about her. Days went by, then weeks. And after a month of Hannah not talking, her parents brought her to the doctor. It was there that she confessed what she had experienced. The doctor asked her what she heard when she played Happy Birthday backwards. And Hannah shook her head and took this deep breath and said, it tells you when your last birthday is going to be. It tells you when you're gonna die. And that's how the uh, story ends. So I guess never listen to Happy Birthday backwards. Why does this make me want to do it on the vlog channel? Should I do it? But I can just imagine how absolutely creepy that would be. All right guys, the next story is called the hairdo. There was a middle-aged woman who was very vain and would always wear her hair up in a big bun. She was very proud of her hairdo and thought she was the most fashionable of all of her friends. Now apparently this woman was also very lazy and didn't like having to spend time cleaning her hair. So instead, she just left her hair up in a bun always. She never took it out, she never cleaned it, she never 
washed it. Whenever she took a shower, she would wear a shower cap to make sure the water didn't mess up her hairstyle. And then even at night, she would sleep with a towel wrapped around her head to make sure that nothing moved out of place. After a while, her hair began to smell and to mask the odor, she would just put hairspray on it. When her scalp started to itch, she would just put hairspray on it. Even though all her head did was itch all day long, she would just continue to put hairspray in it. One morning, when she didn't come downstairs for breakfast, her husband went up to the bedroom to wake her up. To his horror, he discovered that his wife had died in her sleep. At first, the police thought she must have had a heart attack in her sleep because there wasn't a mark on her body. However, when the autopsy was being done on her, they finally examined her hair and found something terrifying. A black widow spider had made its way into the bun of her hair and laid its eggs. And when the baby spiders hatched, they had eaten all the way into her skull and into her brain. And that's how the story ends, guys. Stories like this creep me out so much. Like I literally get the creepy crawlies all over my arms. That's so gross. All right, we have to move on. This next story is called Pedestrian Crossing. During this one evening, this person was standing at the pedestrian crossing on a busy street waiting for the light to change. And they looked over across the street to see the other people standing waiting to walk across as well. They spotted someone that made shivers go down their spine. There was a woman standing on the opposite side of the street who looked very strange. At first they thought that maybe their eyes were playing tricks on them because they could see her pants and jacket perfectly, but her face and hands were a complete blur. So they rubbed their eyes and looked again, but it made no difference. Her face was just so fuzzy and indistinct. They even got this very strange feeling that they could almost see through her, which obviously is not normal. They said this feeling was just so extremely unsettling. Well, the light turned green and people began to walk across the pedestrian crossing. And this woman seemed to be walking straight towards them. So they started to veer to the left, trying to avoid where she was walking. But then the woman started to turn and continued to walk straight towards them. They passed each other in the middle of the street. And as she walked by them, she hissed in their ear and said, I know you can see me. And that's the end of the story. So obviously it's some sort of creepy dark spirit or ghost that usually isn't seen by people. And obviously this person did see them. That's terrifying. Anyway, so guys, those are the three stories I'm going to be telling you today. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you like me doing videos where I tell different short creepy stories, because I love doing this content. So let me know down below if you like this. Once again, if you want to enter to win this new backdrop, be subscribed to this channel, notification bell on, go and follow my Jessie V Instagram account, DM me a black heart. And if you want a second entry, which I don't usually do, go onto my vlog channel and watch the video called This Needs To Be Said and just comment, comment whatever you want. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I love you so, so much. Have a good rest of your day and I will see you in my next one. Bye!